Hi everyone, welcome back to the Tenergy channel. Today, we'll show you how to use some commonly used functions that's included with the TB6 AC 80 watt charger. Let's get started. The first feature we'll cover is loading memory. This charger has a data storage function that helps make it convenient to quickly run programs you frequently use. You can automatically store information from the last 20 operations so that you can charge or discharge without setting up the program again. To load the data, press the decrease or increase button from the main menu until you see load memory program. Now press the enter button to select it. Then press decrease or increase buttons to cycle through the saved profiles. Select the profile you want by pressing the enter button. Here, you can change the values such as the charge or discharge current. Once the setup is complete, you can press and hold enter to start the process. Next, I'll show you how to measure the battery's internal resistance. As Avid users know, a higher internal resistance means more energy is wasted and converted into heat, which reduces the battery pack's performance. Knowing the battery's internal resistance will help you analyze the battery's health and decide when to replace it. Please note that this feature will only work with lithium-based batteries that have a balanced connector. I'll use this lithium polymer or LiPo battery pack as an example. First, we need to connect its connector to the battery. To measure your battery pack's internal resistance, in the main menu, press the decrease or increase buttons until you find extra function program. Press enter to select it. Press enter again to enter the mode that measures internal resistance. The charger will automatically measure the internal resistance and you can see the internal resistance for each cell here. This pack has three cells, so there are three internal resistance values. The TB6 AC charger can check the battery capacity of your battery packs. To do that, find the check capacity function in the extra function program. Connect your battery to the charger. Press enter to select it. Press enter again, then press the decrease or increase buttons to select the battery chemistry type. Then press and hold enter to start. Now the screen will display the battery capacity and voltage here. And if you have the battery balance connector connected, you can also check the individual cell voltage to see if they are balanced by pressing the increase button here. The cell voltages are similar to each other here, so this battery pack is already balanced. Last but not least is the lithium-based battery balancing function. You can balance your lithium battery packs with two cells to six cells as long as it has a balanced connector. To balance your battery pack, connect the battery connectors to the charger. Find the lithium base balance function in the extra function program and press enter to choose it. Press enter again. Now press the decrease or increase buttons to select the battery type. This battery pack is a lithium polymer so I'll choose LiPo for our example. Then press and hold enter to start balancing. The charger will automatically balance the battery pack. Once it's done, the screen will display the charge voltage and elapsed time. You can press the increase button to see the individual cell voltage again. That's it for our tutorial. If you found this video helpful, please leave us a like. If you're still confused about anything, feel free to leave us a comment down below. We'll be there to answer.